Police say Melvin Senville was expecting a delivery yesterday morning, so the man at the front door didn't surprise him. But there was a struggle. The man forced his way in, and the couple found themselves prisoners in their own home. Holy shit! You want to go upstairs? Uh, sure, sure, let's do that. Golly, I'm so impressed. Um, how long is it going to be? Well, it's going to be the biggest at its peak and had to move suddenly. Um, you just want to tuck the cord down a little more. So, uh, no, right in the center. Yeah, there. Okay, good. That's not unusual. Is it big enough for you? Uh, it's probably very big. There's a steam shower here. And here. Lots of sunlight can come in here. You're smiling. I'm smiling very much so. <laughs> What's it been like? It's been a frustration all over. I'm sorry. Um, is there anything unique? I did see some softening, but certainly not tumbling down. Andrea, how typical is this of what you've had to deal with? Well, wood makes it really quite pleasant day or night. You ever feel like Robin Leach? <laughs> Sometimes I do. This was a rather startling thing to get adjusted to, mm -hmm. and I think everybody's rather pleased that it looks as though the end is in sight. Were people depressed about all of this? People were really puzzled. Uh, they really didn't know what to do. We've never had an experience like this. What's the asking price? It's a million one fifty. She's come down sixty thousand dollars. Maybe it's sad. I, I suppose. Well, it's a good buy for somebody, isn't it? <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> Yeah, these are the fun rooms. Oh man, I can't show my wife this. She thought we made it. 